What's going on guys? Bradley Martin here. Normally I would be standing over there in the pretty green grass. Show them the green grass, bro. You're too tired. But I'm too tired, I wanna sit down. But I'm gonna answer these questions anyways. Because um, the grind, don't stop. Who did, who did I quote me? Who did I quote? Who did I quote? They would know if they watched some YouTubers. I don't know. I mean, he hasn't said that in a while, but. Who says that? They'll know, they'll comment below. Yeah? And they'll be like, oh, I hate that guy. And someone will be like, I love that guy. Anyways, so we're doing a Snapchat Q&A. Basically, if you guys want to, hey, you really want to be in this, huh? Okay, come up here. Come up here. Come up. Okay, she doesn't want to be in it. I lied. Um, if you guys want to add my Snapchat and see what I do every day, I probably use Snapchat more than I use Instagram stories just because um, Instagram stories is a bastard plagiarized yes. mf -er, And they just stole Snapchat, basically. So I like, I'm, I'm for the underdog because Instagram... I think is a bigger platform. Well, and they just tried to eat Snapchat, so f fuck you Instagram, but no, nah, I still use Instagram. But anyways, add my Snapchat. Basically what I'm doing is I'm going through, I'm gonna open up these purple boxes because they're gonna be videos of your faces asking me questions. And I'm gonna answer these questions like on the spot. No edits, no cuts. Wait, actually we do edit these ones, don't we? No. No? Well, I better get lucky because we hope they don't ask the magical questions that we don't wanna answer. Oh, Anyways, yeah. let's do it. Who so cares? maybe there is cuts. I don't know. There might be cuts, but when I open it, there's gonna be no cut. Wait, this doesn't make any sense. Let's just answer these questions. Hope for the best. Okay, they're not loaded. They were loading. No, they're not loaded. So <laughs> I'm gonna sit here for a second, and maybe it's because I'm getting so many so fast. Yeah. Like seconds ago. Damn, this is kind of. Look at what's maybe that's why maybe Snapchat's you, losing because maybe you gotta use Instagram. Yo, what do you see this? Can they see that? Loading, loading. And the girls are wrestling over there. It's like there's so much going on today. It's a rough day. Still loading, huh? Got Wi Fi on and everything. We'll come back. We'll come back. You got to come. All right, what's the first one, man? Is so, there... this is the first question. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me uh, zoom in. Wait, one more time? In case you didn't catch that. Hmm. What, what, what's your answer to that? My answer? His answer, I mean, his question was this. My answer is this. All right, cool. Is that next, weird? Next okay, one. Okay, next one. Uh, I want to say thank you. You inspired me. Um, what is one good uh, uh, shoulder lift? Hey, bro, huge <laughs> fan. Uh, I want to say thank you. You inspired me. Um, what is one good... One good shoulder lift to my, my boy, Eli, with two eyes. What is one good shoulder lift? I guess what's your favorite shoulder lift, right? Right now, I'm gonna say laterals, drop yeah. sets. Drop sets? Like, so warm up, work up to a weight that's like uncomfortable, and then keep that weight, like let's say you're doing like, kind of like uncomfortable, like not the best reps. Let's say it's like 35 pounds, for whatever it is. Mine's like 100, obviously, because I do laterals with 100. But let's say yours is like 35 pounds, get up to that weight, like four sets. So do four sets at that weight, but after every time you hit the 35, so it's like eight sets total, you're gonna drop it and go to like a 15. And then a, so, and then a 10. No, it, and yeah, then and then like a five. So that's, but that's one set. It's like, it's three sets is one set. So it's actually not eight, it's, I'm not good at math, but it's four more than eight. With like a minute rest after the three, and then back to it. Okay. Oh man. Next one. Yeah, next one, this is this app is just, What's the most embarrassing thing that's happened to you in the gym? Oh. What's okay? That was Thunder underscore Prius. That's a funny name. Uh, the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to me in the gym. Looking back now, I was not embarrassed, but at the time I was kind of embarrassed because I didn't know what it was. But I actually posted a video of a kid doing this because I didn't have the video of me doing this. It was back in the day before social media was cool, yeah. where we just worked out and like every set I have to film it. Yeah. And basically, I I it's called a. Basal vagal, basal vagal. I don't know what that thing. is. It's basically where like you hold your breath yeah. and you flex like like a certain muscle and it like you hold it and then it, when you release like too much oxygen goes to your brain it like knocks you out. So you knock yourself out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and a kid did this deadlifting. So because you do so a deadlifting. You, so you did that. You like hold your breath. Yeah. Like imagine you're like, and then you're like, ah, and then yeah, too much. You too much pressure and it's like shoo, knocks you out. Oh, that's why people pass out after deadlifts sometimes. Yeah, 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 exactly. So I did a deadlifting. A kid did a deadlift. I posted it on my Twitter the other day. But anyways, point is that was probably one of the most embarrassing moments because like I remember my my boy I was working out with. Um, I was thinking it was pulling. I want to say it was the first time I ever tried to fold five plates. 
Cause he did it and I was like, oh, he does this, I can do this, no problem. Cause that's what my mentality was like back in the day. Um, still is today, right? I just need to get better training partners, which, which is cool. Cause when the gym's open, they'll all be there. So anyways, I did this point five hundred. I like, I'm stuck on the floor. We're just like, uh, and tried for like maybe seven seconds. I held it, right? And then go, come on, go Hayes. I know we love you, but like right now, it's not the time. Not the time, shoot. Don't lick the lens. Don't lick, don't lick the lens. <laughs> so anyways, I knocked myself out and I fell down backwards. I kind of hit my shoulder on, there was a leg press behind me. And, cause I didn't know that cause I was knocked out at this point. But my buddy Brandon told me that. And then I was like, I was like, I woke up doing this. No, you didn't. Yeah, cause I was like, and then I woke up doing this. So I That's like literally, up. I remember waking up and like I'm opening my eyes and I was like, and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I remember thinking like, what the fuck is going on? Like what happened to me? And uh, then I like Googled it and stuff, and then Google diagnosed me. Because yeah, that's my doctor. Anyways, let's keep going. But that was pretty embarrassing. Okay, next one. But a lot of people have done that, actually. Next one, if if Snapchat can uh, get its stuff together, man. What's going on Matthews. these days? This is why Instagram's just killing them right Killing the game, bro. Just make sure you follow my Instagram, because apparently Snapchat's falling apart. Okay. Oh, man. Come back? This is, yeah, we're going to have to come back. Come back. This is, Come on, girls. Did you get Snapchat to work? Uh, it was really, I think it was my trashy internet. I'm oh, not yeah? sure if it was Snapchat or not. But, we're Bradley, back. how much do you curl? Man, we need better questions than that. Yeah. I don't know how much I curl. I've never really tried to max curl. You should. Come on, give me better questions. Yo, Brad, I know this is the third video I've seen you, but it'd Fine. be really cool if I could work at your gym when I got out of the Navy. Is that possible? Let me know. That is a question. That's a question. Yeah. So, obviously, I can't answer that now. I don't know because I'd have to, like, you know, interview and, like, figure out stuff like that. But um, I am hiring people to work on my gym. Actually, I don't even know. When they see this video, I might already have figured it out. Yeah. But in the future, I don't plan on just having one gym. So, there'll be many gyms. And, and then, obviously, more opportunities. Is your gym going to be big enough for everyone that gets a membership there? No, we want to sell, oversell membership. No, I'm kidding. Uh, yeah, of course it is. So we're going to have a membership cap. So that's the idea. We're not we're not like a big chain, 24 LA Fitness, trying to just sell memberships to sell them. We want to like, have a good group of people who like love what they're doing, who are focused on what they're doing. And obviously everyone has different goals, but we're working together. So the idea is to create like a better atmosphere to be in, to work out, to like reach your goals versus just like let's sell as many memberships as possible. There's not going to be incentives to sell memberships or to get memberships like for our team. It's just... People either have them and they love it and they want to be a part of it, or you don't. So that's why we're also having a cap, right? Also because of the size, right? Because it's not a 50,000 square foot facility. It's a it's cap. A cap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I wear a cap. Yeah. No, it is really, like all jokes aside, um, we will have a membership cap. So yes, we're only going to sell memberships so that people can be comfortably comfortable in there and not feel like people are stepping over each other because that's, that's terrible. Too many gyms are like that. Nice one, bro. I'm ready now. Next one. Do you plan on doing YouTube anymore or are you going to leave the mic? Look at this. Look at so See? See? You just watch this. Ah! Ah! I'm going to do this. This is the sixth video. This is the sixth video that I posted. This is the problem. He's like, ah, he doesn't even know that I'm posting YouTube videos. What? What's going on? What's happening YouTube in the sucks, world? Or he sucks. Ah, uh, it's YouTube, bro. Yeah. You don't look at this why YouTube sucks. Let me tell you guys. What you, let me show you why YouTube sucks. This is why YouTube sucks. You guys got to go change this. This is a screenshot someone sent me when they looked at the notifications for my channel. It just says occasional. What does occasional mean? Sometimes. What is that? What is that? Who decides occasional? Okay, like everyone's like, I'm occasionally like text you. What does that mean? I'll text you every four days, every five days. So at some point in time, YouTube basically made that a blanket over everybody who's a subscriber. So everybody, your default, if you clicked Agree to terms probably like six, seven months ago, you, you get occasional notifications from the people you watch. So you probably been like, he's like, bro, you ain't even seen any of my videos. Probably not. We've been posting. So yes, I'm doing videos and I'm posting every damn day at 10 a.m. But if you want, you gotta go change this. You gotta go my notifications on my page and you gotta click all. Otherwise YouTube just F'd you and anyone else you like to watch. Okay. Man, that's annoying, man. But not you, the kid, you're not annoying at all? What was your name? Where? Where's, nope, that was not him. Oh, it's gone now, it's just lost in the soccer hey, space. what's good, it's your boy. I just wanna know, what's your views on marijuana and weightlifting? Ooh, Let me know. marijuana and weightlifting. Whew. Interesting. Um, 
I think anything that's used. Hey, what are you doing? Get down. Anything that's used in excess is not good. Number one. I think. Damn, this is a tough question, man. Hmm. It's like, I don't you, you can answer stuff like this and then you become like a hippie. You're like, yeah, bro, you got, if you feel the muscle, man, it feels that, Arnold you know? did it. Huh? Arnold did it. Arnold did do it. Everyone does it, man. It's that's, legal. That's the truth. Cali, it's legal. Um, it's just a bad, I, I think besides like, it's cool. I guess it's cool. So it's cool. The issue is like, if you turn it into like, I'm going to smoke all the time and do nothing with my life. Yeah. Like, I think if you're going to do it, you have to like be like have a plan yeah if you don't have a plan in moderation too in moderation yeah like if you do it every time problem if you do it every day problem if you do it all the time every day really big problem i think if it's like yo like because i do believe that alcohol and like other things that are legal oh let's call it what it is it's, it's worse frankly i'm gonna talk about it especially as an athlete especially as an athlete um alcohol in particular is like Degenerative, like for your muscle, like it breaks down muscle proteins and shit. I'm not a scientist. I can't go deep into this. I don't know enough to really go to talk so much about it. But I know at least I've my bro science is telling me <laughs> that uh, it's bad for your muscle. Whereas marijuana, even though now now here's some things I have read stuff about like it increasing estrogen. Yeah. So that's that goes to the thing about like. And how how much it does, frequency, I also yeah. don't know. It goes down to frequency. Like if you're doing it all the time, and again, if you're not doing, like if you're doing it and you're like, oh, I'm gonna go work out, and then you like next thing you know, you're like, I'm lazy, I'm gonna sleep, and you're not working out, like that's a bad thing. Yeah, have a plan. Um, understand everything in moderation. Uh, like even go the same things with like alcohol and cigarette, even though like man, I don't smoke cigarettes ever. Yeah, honestly, like you should just never smoke cigarettes. Is that bias that I'm like these other ones are okay, but this one's bad? Is that bias? This is your opinion. You're, yeah, you're entitled opinion. to your yeah, opinion. Yeah, this is a Q&A. Ask me questions. Anyways. Yeah, I mean, that's your honest opinion. That's right? my honest opinion. Um, you're not telling anyone to go do it. You're no, just, this absolutely is your opinion. not. So don't abuse anything. Anything in moderation. You gotta live your life at the I end might, of the day. I might tell the video that. What's that? The last question, I might use that as the title. Marijuana! Because back in the day, they used to make it like it was the devil. Like the the, the the propaganda verse, like that was, it was like, it's gonna kill you. Like, you're gonna kill your family. Like, oh, sh like what? Yeah. Uh, it's more like, you're gonna sleep and do nothing. Yeah. And be lazy. So that's, have a plan. Have a plan. And another thing, don't, like, I guess I, if you're gonna drive to the gym, damn, it's so weird. Cause like, where do they live? And then can they smoke in their car? It's like, what? I don't know. I don't know. That stuff's up to you guys. I'm gonna stop talking about that right now. Okay. Yo, Bradley Martin, are test boosters a waste of money? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. They are. Um, I think there are a lot of like great natural ways to produce, to boost testosterone, but the best way is always going to be like a healthy diet and proper weightlifting routine. Like that's going to help you increase your hormones the most. That's a great next video. Um, what? Three key things you should be doing. Yeah, and everyone sells these things. Like when I when I made Origin, I was like the first thing I made sure of like. And the other people who were involved, I was like, I do not want to sell anything that's like test, test boosters yeah, all the time because that's 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 baloney. Like, Sleep, fucking big ass body. bodybuilders and stuff. Like, it's like, come on, bro, you really you're yeah. using tribulus? Like, they did studies on that. They know that really doesn't work. Like, but you're tricking all these kids to buy it. And the crazy thing about it is, like, you could mark it up like immense markups because those those items are so cheap in bulk. So it's bullshit. It's all money. Now, I mean, there's other things, but like in like gray area. But that's gray hair, and I don't even want to talk about that shit. We're not even wearing gray, dude. Green. And... I don't wear gray, man. Yeah. I mean, these are gray, but it's like a white. It's like off-white black. It's Heather. Look us up, bro, with a discount code for the opening of your gym. Look us up, bro, with a discount code for the opening of your gym. I'm going to. I'm going to do a discount online and a discount in store when everyone shows up to the gym. But I am going to do this kind of like a big discount. But you got to stay tuned. It's not going to be in this tuned. video. No, it won't be in this video. No. You have to like watch the Snapchat or the Instagram yeah. story or you'll lose it. Just, you didn't actually see it. There's no evidence of that. But it's all real. But the paintings, I hate those as well. They're all, uh, all of them. How do you say so flawless with all the, all the flowers? That's weird. I don't know. What do you think about the shit? 
Yo, he's taking a dude. That dude really, he really took a shit and Snapchat at me. Mike Northcraft. Yo! He said, but you gotta answer, what do you think of his shit? I think it was kind of disturbing. Okay, yeah, next question, bro. That was disturbing. I have nothing there. I was wondering if you can send me some Bradley Martin gear, like a hat and a short sleeve shirt or tank top that a chick can wear. Also, one more question. Oh, can she's... you be my uh, date for my you know what's funny? USA huh. debut in Vegas in July? You know what's so funny? Girls are so needy. Did you notice that? Everything was like me, 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 me. Yeah, I need this. Need and the guys you. are just asking questions, and she was like, me, me, me. Um, first question: Can I send her some free stuff? No, because everyone else would be like, "What about me?" Yeah. And especially in this video now. And then two, the, the where? Uh, you a, a competition or July? Something. Probably not. Sorry, I feel bad saying no. Damn. But you can come to the gym and work out. Yeah. That's, a, that's like a really, that's like a, I don't know what the word I was thinking of. You can train one body part a day. I like this guy. What would it be? This, this guy is so smart. If you can train one body part. As he's training arms, he already knew what my answer was going to be. What? Arms. Arms what? Oh no, okay. If, if I, if I, I guess maybe he was like, hold on, let me see. Let me see one more time. Let me. You can train one body part a day. See, if you could is like, I don't, okay, I could, I don't have to. That's, so that's what, I think he made, if you could only train one. Yeah, yeah. It, I can't say arms, because he was training arms. I, love, I wish I could say arms, but I can't, because it's not What do you say? What am I going to say? Yeah. I mean, it's got to be legs, bro. Okay, cool. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, arms. That's the thing that sucks, like, if you only, if you could only do one thing, you're going to do what's going to help you the most, right? Yeah. Like everything else in life, and it's not going to be arms. I'm wondering if you can go more into intermediate fasting. Because I just started the other day and I'm still trying to figure out how it. So I was wondering if you can go more into intermediate. More intermediate fast, more into it. Not in this QA. Is that your video? Shall. Yeah, we'll do that. Remember that. Yeah, yeah. Because I've been meaning to do that for a while. Well, that was a good question. Shaka. Like, hey. That was a. Uh, how many more? It was kick, kick, Two kick, more kick. questions? Uh, I love you, Bradley Martin. But, um, real question now. Uh. How do you get so big and still stay natty? <laughs> That's a secret, bro. It's, it's the internet. All you have to do is... Uh, natty light? Yeah. Natural lighting in the gym. It's from the skylight. Well, yeah, we don't use flashes. Yeah. Natty yeah. fuck, bro. Well, that's why we got skylights. Stuff, but what's your current workout split? Workout split? Oh, I don't have one. I haven't worked out in like six months. What's up, Bradley? I have a quick question. Oh, I met this guy. What can I do to get hired at your gym? <laughs> apply. Damn, that was a cold ass answer. Yeah, you gotta apply. So, Bradley, I mean, it's really that's you bench, and if you have a goal to set it any higher. That was a good one. I wanna, so I wanna know this one, bro. What's, what's the answer? How much do I bench right now? Yeah. Like, bleh. Maybe four or something? Yeah. Um, do I wanna get it higher? Absolutely. Have Why? you ever hit 500 or no? No. I did it, I did it with, uh, um, assistants like, yeah, yeah. like bands. Um, will I get it higher? I'll get 500. I'm gonna say that right now. I'll get 500. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but the fact that now I have a gym and I have everything I've ever wanted, like for sports training, body no good, fucking right? excuses, bro. I have no excuses. So if I don't do it now, then I'm a pussy, and I don't want to be a pussy. I'm bad for cursing. It's all good. We've been cursing the whole time. Fuck it, bro. YouTube really don't care. It's just occasionally you let people know that we're swearing. Yeah, why are you so small? Why are you so small? Um, food. Yo, when you gonna stop by Tulare? Oh, probably never. My where? Tulare, it's like middle of nowhere in California. Brandon's from. I know where Tulare is. Yeah. That's where Hassan's from. Come to my gym, bro. Like, I'm not gonna go to Tulare. Stop where? by here. Hassan, that's where Hassan's from. Yo, yo, yo. Hey, um, what is the best time in the day or night? To go to the gym, get the most gains. There's no best time, day or night, to do that. Um, I think it's just all in your sleep schedule, because and work schedule. And work schedule, obviously. Like I said this before, and this reminds me of another question. Someone's like, "Yo, if you eat carbs past uh, X o'clock or whatever, eight o'clock, is it bad for you? Like, you know, I don't eat past this time because, you know, somewhere on the internet they said. said that 
yeah, they was like, they was all, oh my God, if you eat past eight o'clock, it instantly turns into fat. <laughs> um, <laughs> like that's what they got people thinking. Yeah. And that's false. So as far as like working out, it just depends on like how much food you're eating, like at what times during the day, what's your work schedule like. Maybe you do construction, you're like super tired, so maybe you need to work out before so that you're not like completely like wrecked at the end of the day. I don't know, you know, it's just, it's really a personal schedule, but there's no best time. Um, it's more about how much sleep, how much food you get. How do you show interest to your gym crush when you're shy as hell? Ooh. And not Ooh, try to be thirsty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a good question. How do you show interest to your gym crush when you're shy as hell and not trying to be thirsty? We Everyone knows the answer to this if you watch my channel. Okay. Because we had one video Thank, thank the good Lord that went viral and was about picking up girls and how do we do it Kev? Uh, you talk exactly. I like your shoes. Yeah, what they're shoes nice. Are you talk about their shoes. It's easy. It's 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 uh, what are they wearing flip-flops? Talk about their flip-flops. Oh, yeah, right. I really like the flip the way the flip-flops sit on your feet outside and there's no shoes You got nice feet. Okay, yeah. just keep it on the feet, you know cool because you start from the ground up so everything, you know, and it's Foundation. successful from the ground up. Foundation. So if you go straight to their eyes, they're like, oh, we're both uncomfortable. I'm uncomfortable. You're uncomfortable. This yeah. is awkward. But if you start from the feet, it's like you guys can meet here and then like have a thing. So. Last question. If you're still doing it. It's my boy. What's the best way to increase your hops? Hey. The best way to increase your hops. Hold on a sec. Hey, uh, give me one second. Are you by the gate? I'll be out in a sec. All right, peace. Who's that? The guy for the house, bro. Okay. I'm buying a house. Anyways, the best way to increase your hops. Why don't you answer this one, Kev? You're an expert. I think. I just jump out of pools and stuff. No big deal. You're just naturally a uh, kangaroo, huh? I'm, I'm, I'm essentially a kangaroo. Go ahead, though. What do you think? I think, I mean, the staple of exercises, but training fast, you know? So yeah, I've said so. this in other videos, and I'm going to say it again. Try to train the squat, but like train it explosively. Yeah. Train it like you're going to jump, but don't leave the floor. Yeah. You know, in control. Gonna jump, don't leave the floor in control. So don't do it like you see like most people squat. I'm talking about with any weight. Like even when you start to go heavy, the idea should be like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna jump, but you're not gonna like actually jump because you don't want to leave the floor and like mess your knee up, right? But say you have 135, and you could squat it and it's easy, and you're like going like this. Why not try to go like, yeah. right, in control without the bar like flying off your back and causing a ruckus or some. So. Try that, and I bet you it'll help you. I guarantee you, jump higher. Because it's just the like you're 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 trained to be more explosive, so you're gonna be more explosive. I think the single uh, exercise that's helping the most is pause, uh, pause explosive squat. pause explosive squat. Yeah, because you're jumping through, you're yeah. going, you're pushing through that point like where the you hardest part where you would squat, jump. Then boom. Yeah. Okay. One more. Hey, if you don't do crunches, what do you do for ab workouts? That's, that's a good one. Uh, hanging leg raises, deadlifts. Benching, squatting, yeah, dips, uh, unilateral work, unilateral work. So, well, it's one arm, like one arm stuff. It's all involving the core, so not direct like abdominal work, but things where it's like a. Australia. Hold on, we'll do now, I just wanted to know what makes you different from every other fitness wannabe out there. Peace, brother. I'll let you guys answer that. So you guys answer his questions in the comment below. I didn't know you're a fitness person. I'm not. Oh. I just the, the fitness life chose me. I didn't choose the fitness line. All right. On that note, I'll see you later. Stop, this dude. Is, what is that? Super That's woman S. Thing? That's Superwoman. Superwoman. Oh, what's the zoo? What's the zoo? Dude, we gotta make a zoo one. Make no, we have one. it. I have it. It's. Wait. Remember, Trent had it. How does it go? I don't know. Bro, help me out. I don't know, bro. Figure it out. Is that the Z? Yeah. Or is that the Z? Yeah, that's the Z. Is that a Z? Boom. Yeah. Hey. Zoo. That's for the zoo. Boom. Can you see it? Yeah. Okay, I'm out. I love you guys. Wait, uh, we gotta get a thumbnail. Just I'll, be picturing me and the dogs. I'll get one. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna. I already know what you're gonna do. We got it. Yeah. <laughs> ah!